Aster Phil and Stella is a series of sonnets penned by Sir Philip Sidney, likely composed in the late 16th century. The sonnets explore the unrequited love story between Aster Phil, the poet's persona, and Stella, his star. Many believe these sonnets were Sidney's response to discovering that his childhood love had married someone else. In the sonnets, Aster Phil falls deeply in love with Stella, though she does not reciprocate his affections initially. She neither encourages nor rejects his advances. Eventually, Stella marries another man, but this only intensifies Astorphil's attraction because her marriage is unhappy, and he admires her self-sacrifice. Although Stella eventually returns his love to some extent, she maintains her resolve not to consummate the affair due to her vows. The sonnets reflect Astorphil's increasing passion and desire for Stella, leading to irrational behavior, such as stealing a kiss from her while she sleeps. This breach of trust strains their relationship, and Stella pulls away from him, causing torment for Aster Phil. He later acknowledges his wrongdoing and expresses deep remorse, but their relationship remains doomed. Stella becomes ill, and her anger at Aster Phil's persistence leads to the end of their affair. The series ends with Aster Phil alone and isolated, but still cherishing the memory of his love for Stella. Sidney draws inspiration from Petrarch's rhyme scheme and explores themes of love versus reason, the conflict between purity and desire, and the idea that love cannot always be restrained by reason. Sir Philip Sidney's Astor Phil and Stella introduced a new style of poetry to England during the Renaissance, marking a change in literary production. In the end, Astor Phil realizes that despite the pain and ultimate end of their relationship, he is happier for having loved Stella passionately and knowing that she once loved him in return. Love, he concludes, is a force that cannot always be contained by reason. I hope you enjoyed this video, leave a like if you did, and be sure to subscribe thank you.